Water pumps have been a crucial part of the human development story and these have ranged from being simple devices to really complex machines. Now the most common form of a water pump that we can all relate to is a good old hand pump. But how does the hand pump work exactly? A hand pump is also called a reciprocating pump. It has a piston that moves up and down to draw the water up from the ground and deliver it through the spout. There are two one-way valves inside that open up in the same direction. One valve is located on the piston and the other is placed at the base of the pump. When the plunger is pushed down, the piston moves up and opens the valve at the bottom to draw water from the ground. When the plunger moves down, the valve attached to the piston opens up, allowing the water to enter the spout, but the valve at the bottom closes due to the downward pressure of water. Which is why these pumps have to be worked a few times before we can get water flowing. And this is also a very tiring process. But what if we could automate the whole thing? An automated reciprocating pump does the same job, but much faster. And the construction is also somewhat similar. In such pumps, the two one-way valves are placed at an offset and the piston is operated using a crankshaft that is run by a motor. When the piston moves up, it creates a vacuum forcing the bottom valve to open up and allow water to enter the pump. When the piston moves down, the bottom valve closes and the water is pushed towards the other valve which opens up due to the pressure of the water, allowing it to pass through the pump. But this design again doesn't allow for a continuous flow of water. In a single action pump, water is delivered for every two strokes of the piston. But in double action pump, this can be changed to every stroke of the piston. In such pumps, there are four valves that operate. Each pair of valve is operated for every stroke of the piston. So when one pair of the valves is drawing water into the pump, the other pair is pushing it out. But this type of pump also has a disadvantage to it. Can you find out what it is and let us know in the comments?